This is the A533 Runcorn Road towards Northwich. Again, A-class road as we say, de-restriction zone at the moment and the centre line at the moment is uh, just a central road marking. You'll see how that changes when you start to come to some hazards. Obviously the road surface here is agricultural, just look at the amount of rubbish that's on the road that's been brought out by a farmer. You're going to have to sacrifice position to get into the safest zone on, on the road here. Uh, it's no good trying to hold your, your best position on the road for, for cornering or anything else. You've just got to look at where the, the cleanest patches are and get out onto those because that's the only way you're going to be able to break if anything happens. As you can see this is a big long straight section of road at the moment so you can build up some good speed down here but the speed limit is restricted to 60. Still the tractor, the tractor markings down here so you've got to be thinking that that tractor's around somewhere, they look quite fresh, it could be turning in or out and agricultural vehicles are always a problem. Staggered junction, slow sign on the road there, you see how the motorcyclist there is taking the uh, furthest position away from that near side junction and now he's moving away from the junction that's on the off side of the road, that's good riding uh, he's taking note of all the, the problems. So now we're coming into the first right hand bend and taking a good position towards the near side, now going towards a left hander, slow sign on the road, taking a nice central position towards the off side of the road, increasing his view, maintaining a nice steady progressive acceleration, not building up speed, just nice pull from the engine, coming into a double white line system, this means that there's a problem ahead, now it's braking so that means that the road will open out a little bit but we're already coming into a 30 limit and he's got his speed down before he gets into there. We also noted there that was um, a series of bend sign, double bend and uh, we're just coming into those now. Lots of hazards going on here, junction onto the left hand side, there's the sign for it, slow signs on the road. Lots of paint at this section and that, that always tells you that wherever the local authority or the highways agency have put paint on the road that means that there are lots and lots of hazards. Look, look how far this tractor's been going, there's still fresh uh, slurry all over this road. So this tractor's still around somewhere, we've not found the position where he's moving in or out of. But uh, just note the, the amount of hazards that you've got, and as I say, it's always a good indication wherever the, there's a lot of paint, that's a lot of money being spent, and they don't do that unless there's lots of problems and hazards. And really it's up to you to note them, and not just look at them, you've got to react to them. So maintaining a nice steady speed through here, Everybody else will be anticipating traffic travelling through this area at or around 30 miles per hour. Motorcyclists often go through these sort of areas quicker than that and even a speed of 40, 45 miles an hour through here will catch out pedestrians, it will catch out people on pedal cycles, people pulling in and out of junctions. These are all problems that uh, urban riding creates for you. And you can see there are pedestrians there, there's people walking, there's people out with um, uh, parked cars, driveways, lots and lots of things going on so you've just got to pick your way through these sort of things before you get back out into the de-restriction areas where you can start to position and go through the corners and the bends again.